Hey, what's up everybody? Today we're gonna to be talking about low gear and no finish line and what that means and what it looks like for you and how it could propel you forward inside of your life. I'm Nate Bailey. This is uh, my Mindset Matters channel and thank you so much for taking some time to be with us here today. <laughs> low gear like we all have a low gear and I think there's this tendency when people hear low gear inside of their life they think that oh man it's moving slow it's not really getting a anywhere quickly and, 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 and that's the problem with today's society right we want to go from a thousand air to a millionaire in a week right you want to go from making a little bit of money to a lot of money we want to go from weighing uh, 300 pounds to 200 pounds in a short amount of time but the problem is obviously and I think you can see it coming that there is work to be done there are steps along the way that can't be skipped and the way that we get anywhere and, and I'm gonna have you try this on and consider it for yourself is that the way that you can start to really win in life not just physically and financially but relationally spiritually the way that you can really start to win and really start to stack some wins on top of each other one upon each other step by step to the point where you you get to to uh, a certain a certain time frame and you look back and you realize that wow I've actually come a long way simply by embracing low gear so low gear is it's, it's just that it's it's this current reality starting point that you're at we got this this uh, this prize that we are trying to uh, attain and we're just gonna we're gonna put it into low gear like if you ever drove stick shift right you got fourth gear third gear second gear first and maybe reverse down here right and we're gonna we are just in neutrals in in here we are going to put it into low gear we're gonna put it into first gear and we're just gonna start to do work we're gonna start to do what's required necessary required actions and RAs you're gonna just start to do work day after day day after day day after day low gear and then there's gonna be this tendency that you're gonna to want to put it into second gear or you're gonna to want to put it into fourth gear and I'm gonna tell you to just stay where you are and then time after time day after day as you get closer to this prize right this thing that you're looking for this big goal this big outcome if you stay in low gear eventually your low gear compared to everyone else's is second gear and then you're going to keep moving and you're going to keep working every day you're going to put in the work you're going to do what's required and then eventually your low gear is now third gear compared to everyone else's first gear so you're picking up what I'm putting down here the more that you stay in the slow gear the more that you move the more that the machine gets get, the wheels get greased right you maintain and you take care of this vehicle that's helping you to get with, to where you want to go by staying in this low gear you start to move a little quicker a little more efficiently a little more effectively and eventually your low gear because you've been doing this every single day over a long period of time becomes your new normal so now you are you're moving in fourth gear trucking along at a high rate of speed but it's still a low gear to you versus everyone else that they say okay I'll, I'll go low gear for a while I'll try this out and then it's not fast enough for them they're not seeing the results as quickly as they would like to and so guess what they quit they stop they stop moving the vehicle it seizes up because it hasn't been used the wheels they lock up they rust up and then when they try to start again guess they have to start all the way back here at low gear one because they didn't commit because they stopped they never get out of first gear and you're over here in fourth cruising and moving along but it's still low gear to you because you've been putting in the time you've been putting in the work over here slowly inching towards your prize 
until one day you hit the prize. We talked about celebrating wins the other day. So you celebrate the wins, you recalibrate, and then you come back here and guess what? That's where no finish line comes in because no finish line. Hashtag NFL. There is no finish line. So once we reach this prize, this destination inside of low gear, we don't quit. We just reset. We recalibrate. We put our vehicle back in low gear, which to most, because we've been doing this and we've been consistent and we've been committed over a long period of time, is really a high gear. And then we do it again. And then we just keep putting that work in, right? Keep putting that work in. Hashtag every single day, every single day, and our low gear, and our low gear, our low gear, until we hit the prize again. And we do it all over. There's no finish line in life. Quit looking for the finish line. Enjoy the journey. Live your life. Get to this point in your life where your low gear to, to everyone else is a high gear. The Navy SEALs, I talk about this all the time. They will regress back to their lowest level of training. So their low gear has to be extremely high because when the bullets are flying, the lives are on the line. And if they can't move at an extremely efficient and effective level of tactical dominance, right? If they can't move faster and more efficiently, more fluidly than the enemy, like they're, they're not gonna come home. And so they embrace low gear. There is no finish line. There's a mission, but once that mission's over, guess what they do? They go back to the basics. They go back to the fundamentals. They go back to work and they get back right here into that low gear, which is a high speed for them compared to everyone else because they never stop moving. They stop stopping. So for you, stop stopping, get into that low gear, slowly increase that low gear for yourself so that it actually looks like a high rate of speed to everyone else. And there is no finish line. Quit looking for the finish line. We're never done. You are never done. The minute you stop, again, the vehicle seizes up, it rusts up and it won't move. And your low gear will regress back to first gear. So that's what I got for you today. Take a look inside of your life. Where can you find that low gear and just slowly, steadily, smoothly keep moving forward towards what it is that you want, this prize over here. Once you reach this prize, because you will if you stay consistent every single day, no finish line, you will, you will hit this prize. And then you just reset, recalibrate, and you do it again. And you continue to keep moving. That's what I got for you, Nate Bailey here. Mindset Matters. Thank you so much. Have a great day.